rates of anxiety, depression, and other mental health issues are still on the rise. And while traditional treatments do exist, some supporters of psychedelic mushrooms hope they can open new doors for the future of mental health. Fox News correspondent Marianne Rafferty takes a look at how the concept is gaining traction here in the state. With the nation facing higher rates of mental health problems, advocates of magic mushrooms hope the fungi can be a possible remedy, citing how the mushroom's psychedelic effects can alter a person's thinking, helping them develop new coping strategies and overcome trauma. I met several people that had experienced healing. After being treated with two doses of magic mushrooms and given psychotherapy, adults who misused alcohol had an 83% decrease in their drinking, according to a study published in the journal JAMA Psychiatry. Some researchers say the mushrooms can also provide relief for PTSD and severe depression. This kind of journey is not for the faint of heart. Kathy Jonas owns the Epic Healing Center in Oregon, the first state to legalize adult use of magic mushrooms. She already has a waiting list of more than 3,000 people looking for treatment. This is very much about supported use for adults 21 years of age or older, um, and that support comes from licensed facilitators who don't handle or sell the psilocybin products, but instead instead provide preparation, administration, and integration sessions to clients. But while the Oregon Psychiatric Physicians Association calls the mushrooms unsafe, supporters hope the practice will gain wider acceptance as a new method of treating mental health issues. The FDA recently issued recommendations for researchers designing clinical studies around psychedelic drugs and mental disorders. Marianne Rafferty, Fox News. So while the fungi can lead to feelings of euphoria and cause hallucinations, mm -hmm. some critics of magic mushrooms say more research is needed. Yeah, they also caution how shrooms can cause users to experience potentially dangerous psychotic episodes, paranoia, nausea, and other negative side effects. Definitely a good idea to keep it closely monitored with a, a specialist if you yeah. decide to try that path.